people sorry <laughs> sorry I'm I'm looking at my camera trying to figure out stupid settings and stuff I haven't been able to get the computer to work yet so I'm back on my phone but it's not working well I don't think so we'll see how this goes so how are you guys hi Jackie hi Heather are you guys doing good? Yes, I am back. Oh, now, see, I don't know what I did. Oh, why is it doing this? There it is, okay. Huh, sorry. It's been a little bit trying to fix everything up here so hey Selena how are you thanks for coming I appreciate it so how is everybody doing today oh I'm so glad you got your jobs done Heather Thank you for being here to support me. I really do appreciate it. So, I even painted my nails today. They didn't turn out as well as they should have. For some reason, the top coat, like, ate the sticker underneath. So now it looks weird, but it kind of reminds me now of, like, mermaid skin. Like, fin, like, her tail skin. It's weird, right? I know. I'm weird. I know that. So, and apparently my screen is very blurry too. Wow. I really need to figure this out. So, so yeah, I actually was talking to Victoria today when I painted my nails. It was fun. Thanks. I like it. I haven't painted my nails for like ever. I used to get my nails done when I worked and stuff, but when I stopped working, it just, there wasn't the money to do it. And I just didn't see the point because, you know, yeah. So I'm all excited. I bought a bunch of like nail stuff at the dollar store the other day. So I'm going to show you guys all of it because, well, I'm all excited. So I went to um, the Dollar Tree and then I went to um, Dollarama and I was going to go to Michael's, but I didn't even have to go to Michael's. I found everything I needed at like, oh, good. Thank you. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I was so excited. So, um, yeah, I guess I can start showing you guys. So I don't remember where or which store I got most of the stuff in. It's all kind of mixed together now, but yeah, it was either Dollar Tree or Dollarama. So, um, I'll go through like the nail stuff really quickly cause you know, no big deal. But so I got like these colors. 
Of those. And then there's this top coat. And then there's another one. And another one. And another one. And another one. I think that's it. Oh, one more. Those are the colors I bought. I'm so excited because I bought like some stencils and Now it's going to work, maybe. So yeah, okay, maybe for a little bit it'll work. So I got these in black and gold, and then that's what's on my fingers right now is the silver one. So they're pretty, very pretty. But don't put a top stories with them. So I got those, and then I got these, which are just 10 full and 10 French different ones. So try those out see how they work and then I got these stencils so I'm pretty excited you know doing my nails keeping my nails pretty and all of that so yeah so that's all my nail stuff nothing super exciting in that I know but I was excited so and then I got these pencil cases, which this one is like super trippy. It, uh, yeah, it moves. It's very cool. I like it. So these are my new pencil cases because when I'm doing a project, I like to pull my pencils and normally I just put them in elastics and then stick them in a plastic baggie. And that's just not conductive to keeping them safe. So here's my new project pencils cases. So I'm excited about those. And then I got what else did I get? Everything's falling apart. So then I got this pencil case, which I'm hoping will be big enough for because I got the Prisma um, port or skin tone set for Christmas so I, I want to put them in this case here so that's what that case is for and then I just got some chapstick and just some sticky glue for my stickers and stuff like that and some white out and then I found this tape at the dollar store, which I thought was really pretty, and you get lots of it, so I have some washi tape. Yay! So I got that, and then I got this like Crayola thing where you kind of make your own stationery with transfers and stuff. So that's what that is. And then I just got baggies for um, my diamond painting stuff. So I picked up lots and lots of baggies. So I just put all this stuff in here for now. It's like way too big to even close, but it's holding it for now. And then I got I got this pencil case, which is beautiful. It's kind of see-through, but it's not. It's so pretty. And I picked up some um, brush pens. From the dollar store so most of them are crap and the tips aren't great they're like all you know separated and whatnot but there's a couple that have decent tips so I'm trying to learn how to do um, lettering so this will help with my brush lettering so that's what those are for and then at the dollar store, I found two sets of the big intensity markers that I didn't have. 
So one or two of them might be ones I have, but most of them aren't. So that's what the case looks like with nothing in it. It's just so pretty. Hi, Abby. How are you? Thanks for coming. So that was what I got from in this bag. And then I'm like... I got some paper, which is really pretty. So I think it's really pretty. So I got that kind of paper and I got this kind of paper, which I mean, I'm sure I don't have to show you, you can see it, but it's really prettier to look at the whole page. So I, that makes me dizzy when people do that. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> Yes, everybody, please be patient with me. I am working on making my streams better. I'm working on trying to use the computer. So um, so then I got this paper, which is really pretty because, yeah. And then I got dual tip markers and about these and then I got stickers and planner stuff so yeah we'll just move that out of the way so then I got these stickers and um there's like four sheets of them and I just think they're cute so I got those and then I got um you know sticky notes so I thought they'd be cool and then I found these sticky notes which I thought were very cool I'm very excited about those. And then um, and then I got these ones and they have they're like different colors and stuff and you can write on them. And then there's more on the back in different colors. So I got those. And then I got these ones, which I thought would go really well with some of the paper, because the paper's for my planner. So I saw somebody like, you know, cut out little pages with their papers the papers for so there's that one an aquatic one which so yeah so there's that and then just some remember ones and more functional type things these ones are really functional which i like because i feel like i was really missing out on functional paper so yeah, so, and then I got these stickers, which this is the alphabet they give you, and I can't say I'm, like, super happy with it, but for a dollar twenty-five, even if I take that away, there's still some really pretty stickers in here, so I just thought they were so pretty, and yeah, they're, like, a buck, so, yeah. And then there's these ones. So, do small things with great love. And then they give you another one of the alphabet. So I guess if I decide I like it, I have lots of those. <laughs> and then, oh, I had to buy these ones because I love owls. Like, love owls. So I got these ones and... They're a little, like, sticky uppy, but I thought they were just so worth it. So I got these ones. They're beautiful. And then my uh, these ones are the ones that are exciting because I needed more functional stickers for my planner. So I got these ones, and I know these are from the uh, Dollar Tree. So I got these ones, and there's, like, chores and different ones on the back, and they're awesome. And then here's type colors and whatnot here which is awesome this one's really pretty I love the pink and the blues and I don't like the orange so much but it kind of goes I'm okay with it and it's got some cool ones on the back like July 4th and you know Hanukkah I don't know trick-or-treat I love my mom I should make my kids give me that sticker and then I found these ones, which again, more function. 
is what I wanted. And there's these ones, which I thought were really pretty. Pencil this in. I absolutely love that sticker. It's like fabulous. I think it's fabulous. And then I got a pack of butterfly stickers because they were just really pretty. So, and then the only other stuff I got is like two different calligraphy handwriting Crayola books. So, yeah. So that's what I got from the dollar store. It's probably, you guys probably didn't want to see all that. It was boring, but I was super excited and I haven't like opened it because I've been waiting to show everybody. So now I can go through and like sort out my stickers and get everything ready and stuff like that. So I'm excited. So thank you for, you know, putting up with me. <laughs> I know that my stuff is probably boring, but I'm excited. So I thought it was so awesome because I fully intended to go to Michael's to pick up some stickers for my planner. And I totally like went to the dollar store and found all of this stuff. And it was like, I didn't even have to go to Michael's to get a sticker book. Like for, it was, um, so these are like a buck 25 per thing and you get 300 stickers so if I buy like you know four of them it's five bucks and I get 1200 stickers and you know the happy planner ones are beautiful and nice but you know obviously price wise you can't compare at all so yeah so that was my haul so I'm pretty excited now I gotta go put a ton of stuff away. <laughs> so, what are you guys all working on today? Have you guys been coloring at all or anything? Thank you, you guys. I appreciate that. I don't know if this will fit here. I'm gonna try them. Maybe. I have like way, way, way too much stuff. And if I say it too loud, my husband will agree and make me get rid of some. Your color morphia pick? That's turning out really good, I think. I think I saw that one. This is what I've been working on. So I wanted to color. I haven't colored in a while. I've just felt like I haven't been able to. So I am... Um, I wanted to color something for Jackie and for Victoria for their color alongs. And so I thought this was kind of perfect because it's Hannah Lynn, so it fits Victoria, and it's Mermaid, so it's for Jackie too. And since I haven't colored in so long, I figured it was a good place to start. Just a nice, easy picture. And I'm using my alcohol markers for the first time. I've never used them before, so this is like so cool. So yeah, I all I've done is alcohol marker. And I haven't shaded or anything like that. Um, I did try to shade the top of the eyes a little bit darker, but beyond, and the shell, I did the shell. But then I thought the shell looked silly, so I didn't shade anything else, but that's okay. I mean, first time using markers, I think it's not so bad. So yeah, that's what I've been up to. And yeah, so... I'm pretty excited. Yay! Seahorses are awesome. Those are boy seahorses because I know they're carrying babies. I just decided. Farts in a glass jar. Patty. Hi, Patty. Oh, what are you diamond painting, Abby? <laughs> it's a good thing everybody knows you're my sister, Patty. <laughs> oh, you picked another one for Victoria's color along, Heather? Hi, Tracy. How are you? Thanks for coming. 
I finished all the ones that I had. And I don't have anything left to diamond paint. I'm very sad about that. <laughs> yeah, no more diamond painting. <laughs> Not for a little while anyway. I love it though. I found it so relaxing. Like I just never wanted to stop. And um, I was having some pretty bad panic attacks for a while. And diamond painting was so helpful because... I sat there and I, you know, concentrated on each individual. Panic attacks, but diamond painting was super helpful for that. So, yeah. And there it goes again. It was totally great. And, oh, my God, I'm really sorry about my stream, everybody. I is saying now that it's fine and then it just dropped. I don't know. So how are you doing, Patty? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I seriously, send me your diamond paintings and I will diamond paint them and send them back. I would be thrilled to do that. I wish I could have a business that would be like diamond paintings for you. You want a diamond painting but don't want to go through the hassle of doing it yourself? Send it to me. I'll do it for you and you can have it back. That would be so awesome. Oh no, Abby, that sucks. <laughs> uh huh. Uh, better in the past couple days. So, oh my god, that sucks, Abby. I've, I almost fell asleep and I had like a tray full of them. And the only thing that saved me was, well, some did fall out, but I had a blanket on, so the blanket caught them instead of them going all to the floor. I totally understand. <laughs> oh god, that's horrible. <laughs> I don't need to keep all the diamond paintings because where am I going to put them if I keep continuing doing them? So, you know, it would be great to just do them and send them away. That would make me happy. Oh, no, Tracy. exact same color don't have to DMC codes they're just whatever code they are off from wherever I buy them I guess but yeah I I don't know how I would even order more of those that would suck so bad And I'm not used to coloring with markers. I was coloring yesterday while I was watching Heather's stream. And I was sitting here and I was holding and watching my phone. And I forgot that, like, when, I, when I'm working, I work with, like, two colors and I leave the lids off. And I forgot I had markers instead of pencils. And so I had it, like, in my hand and I was holding it. And I had this big blotch on my sweater where I... um accidentally mm -hmm. hmm I don't know what that was so yeah I got a big blotch on my sweater the good thing was I was actually using blue markers at the moment so my sweater is blue so it's not so bad but yeah still big alcohol marker stain have to remember you know they're markers not pencils <laughs> yeah or just if you have like a clean bag just vacuum them up 
Yeah, I try not to put very many drills in my trays at once because I'm like, if I fall asleep or, you know, if I don't finish and there's still drills in there, I leave it them in the tray on the table. But I work on the kitchen table. So, you know, my family, they have to eat and move and do stuff. So, yeah, I. Um, I. Uh, I worry about the drills dropping like all the time. So if I leave them out, I like hide them behind what I'm doing or whatever. So. Yeah, I sit here and I work on the kitchen table, which is fine for the most part. But then all of a sudden, you know, if I drop drills, Darren's like, he hears it because they clink on the floor. And he's like, oh, my God, you dropped more drills. And they're like, tick, 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 all over the floor. And he gets so frustrated with me. And I try so hard to pick them up, but they're so small. You miss them. <laughs> so, yes, I, uh, I drop drills a lot. I'm very clumsy. <laughs> Yeah, it's so easy to just, you know, drop them and you don't even think. And it's just like, oh, my God, suddenly there's drills everywhere. And yeah. Definitely blame it on your dog, Tracy. I would. It's all the dog. Dog made me do it. And it felt like I could go out in my shorts and have a Sunday. Oh, my God, it was so warm. I mean, last week it was like minus 44 with the wind chill. So, yeah. Diamond painting. Um, it is a craft where you get, I can show you. It's so awesome. Sorry. So this is diamond painting. So you get a canvas and then you get, um, hold on. You get these things, which are little tiny bits of resin and they're called drills. And so what you do is you take a little pen with some wax in it that sticks to the drills. And the canvas has glue on it. It has an adhesive. And so you take your little pen um, and it has wax on it. And you pick up the dot and then you put it down in the little square. So there's squares all under here. And the... Um, this one's from the dollar store. Morgan and Ian got me this one for Christmas. And so you just take these tiny little dots and you just put them down. And you can get ones where you can put three at a time, six, nine, ten different placers. But I only do mine one at a time. So I did this one. And then I did this one. So these were my Christmas presents. So I did that one, and then I did this one. And I had these done, like, by New Year's, these three. And then I I bought a bigger one, and it's done. So you have glue, and then you get dots of different colors, and you just pick up the dot and stick it on there, and you keep doing it over and over. It's very much like cross-stitch, which is where it's based from. So, nor like, some of the better companies use DMC codes, so like the embroidery thread DMC. And if you wanted, you could take this pattern, like you probably but take a picture of it before you started drilling it, and you could like cross stitch this and just pick up the same colors that it tells you to. So if I had taken a picture, I could have cross stitched this one, but I didn't, so that's okay. 
So yeah, that's what it is. And it's very, very addictive. Like, oh my god, I just want to you. I can try and show my the room. It's a little bigger, but I can try. So then I have this one, which is obviously way, way, way bigger than I have here, but there's the bottom of it. There's the top, and then over here. This one, though, the canvas is completely messed up. There's, um, like, bulges in the canvas itself, and... Yeah, it, there's the canvas is crap, and I'm really worried about popping drills on this one. But once I frame it, it'll be okay. So, yeah, that's that one. I love this one. So, I thought it was beautiful. So yes, those are my diamond paintings. And now I need more. Like, it's it's a need. It's a necessity. It really is. Darren does not understand this need or necessity that I'm talking about. <laughs> he keeps saying no, no. But he doesn't understand how important it is. Like, oh my gosh. I feel like lost without having something to diamond paint. It's weird. I mean, I literally just started doing it, but yeah, I absolutely love it. The best thing is like, you don't have to worry about picking colors. You don't have to worry about shading. You don't have like my clam looks absolutely dumb because I tried to shade it, but and I don't know how to use alcohol markers at all. So, <laughs> but um, it's, it's so calming and relaxing. And like there were big blocks of black on that. And I tried using the placers, but I just like placing them one by one. So if you ever want a diamond painting, Patty, you let me know. And, you know, you can pick it out. If you pay for it, I will do it, and I will pay to ship it back to you. That's how much I want to do one. And I want a bigger one. Like, it's like now that I've done those, it's, it's like I want harder and bigger. And, yeah, I just want bigger <laughs> and harder. I want to try square for sure. That's, I guess, my next goal is to try square, but, yeah. I'm like totally addicted. I absolutely love it. It is just so calming. And it was so wonderful with my panic attacks. Like when, you know, Darren wasn't here and stuff like that. And I had to deal with them on my own. It was so helpful. So, yep. I'm all about the diamond painting now. So... <laughs> Patty says happy birthday. It's my husband's birthday today. I felt really bad because I, you know, told everybody yesterday that I was going to stream and then I remembered it was his birthday and I'm like, oh dear. And I'm like, you know, I told him that I wouldn't stream if he wanted to, you know, do something or watch something or whatever. And he's like, no, you're streaming. And he gave me, like, no choice. So, you guys are stuck with me because he wants to play video games. <laughs> yeah, that's how it works. Yeah, get rid of Dusty so I can play video games and I don't have to, you know, listen to her talk or have her try to talk to me. So, yeah. <laughs> Full square drill. 
I'm hoping to get it done by the end of the month. Oh, I can't wait to see it, Tracy. That would be so awesome. Heather and Jackie say happy birthday, too. He says thank you, everybody. He's in the middle of a video game, so, you know. Which is good. He's busy. I'd feel bad if he was sitting there all, like, sad and lonely on his birthday. Because, you know, our 15-year-old daughter won't sit around and talk to him, right? <laughs> yeah, she's got other people to talk to that are more important than dad, so. <laughs> I'm just kidding. She's not like that at all. She's actually a very, very good kid. So. One thing I keep forgetting with the markers is how much they bleed. I keep forgetting that. And then I, I mean, here it's not bad because they're basically like almost the same color. So if it bleeds, you don't notice it afterwards. But I had like, I have had everything bleed everywhere. I don't think there's one color that I haven't been like, crap, that's not supposed to be there. So I have to remember that. Alcohol markers take a lot of remembering. Tracy says happy birthday too. Thank you. <laughs> right, Heather? Oh, 40 by 50. That's a good one. That's a good size. I mean, I've heard squares are really hard. I mean, I guess nothing is really hard when it comes to diamond painting, but you know what I mean. So I totally get that. Is the one by one? You guys use, like, do you use place? <laughs> exactly. I love looking at the back of the page. I think that's my favorite part about the markers is looking at the back. It's just, I don't know. I like the back very much. Selena says happy birthday too. Thanks everybody. What are you working on Selena, like diamond painting? Do you have one going or? I can't wait until like one day when I can buy one from um, like Diamond Art Club or somewhere like that. That's got me really excited. I very much would like to get one from there or somewhere like there. Like, because so far, like the ones I've worked on are just like, you know, the very, very cheap canvases from Amazon. Like there's nothing to them really. Um, and yeah. Like the one canvas is all stretched and stuff, but it's still fun to do. I don't care. Not really. I just want to do them. But yeah, one day I'm going to get like a really big one and it's going to, I'm going to get a difficult one. I really, really want to get a cup. diary for like the house but I would really like to do like one of Morgan and Ian for them for like you know an engagement gift or whatever so I think that would be very cool cool what's your new one of Selena Yeah, I had Morgan and Ian here last weekend on Saturday, and I made sure I left, like, diamond painting so that they could try it, because Morgan was supposed to come over Tuesday, and then the weather was so cold last week that I didn't want her taking the bus over or anything, so um, we switched it to Saturday, which worked out way better anyway, and so the part of the reason she was coming over was to try diamond painting, but then I had to, like, stop I'm in painting so that I made sure that you know there was some for her to do so that was kind of funny um 
so yeah, she came and she tried it. And then after work, Ian came over and he tried it. And I think I have both of them completely hooked. Like they were like waiting until they could go to the dollar store and find some. I didn't see any when I was there at either store. Actually, I would have bought them if I did. But yeah, I didn't see any at either store. So it's flawless and the drills are great too. Awesome. That oh thank you Tracy. That would be awesome. A fairy tale. Oh good Selena. That is so cool. Oh it's so nice to find places where you can get good stuff from and like share the info, right? Like cuz I mean I I wouldn't I don't care if I buy off Amazon or AliExpress like you know, I don't care where I buy from. I just want to buy them so that I can do them and I don't really care if you know I can't afford expensive ones so it's good to find a good seller on a place like AliExpress because it's no cheaper buying them off Amazon than buying them off of like Wish or AliExpress oh my god I have one coming latest you 43 colors Unicorns. AliExpress is a place to go buy really cheap stuff. Like, you know what Wish is, Patty? It's kind of like that. Sweet. I have one coming. So it was like $3.99. And it said, so it when I looked at the picture. It showed a five panel one. So like the big one in the middle, the two medium ones on the side, and then the two smaller ones. And it said the size was 17 and three quarter inches by 35 and some odd inches. So I'm thinking it's all the five panels and that I'm going to get this big um, diamond painting is what I'm thinking and is what I'm hoping, but it was only $3.99. So I'm concerned <laughs> about what exactly. And it filled the whole love seat and like they didn't space them apart or anything. They were still really close. So it said it was full drill, but I, I'm not sure how this is going to work. So I can't wait until this thing arrives. It's supposed to arrive sometime between January 27th and February 18th. So I'm like so excited to see this thing because I have no idea if it's going to be the full one or if it didn't seem a way to buy any other pieces for it. So I think I have it. But yeah, I'm like super excited to see when that one comes in because that'll be cool. Like each one separately isn't that big, but I mean, that'll be cool to put on the wall if it's a five panel one. store is why I drill handmade store I have a pen you know I have like 200 markers in front of me and everything else and I do have pens but you know couldn't find them at the moment so why I drill handmade store thank you guys so much Hey, Mia. Thanks for coming, sweetie. Thank you so much. Uh, 
Heather or Tra the Victoria might be here a little later if she can make it. Thanks, Mia. Does anybody want to be a mod? I feel guilty asking people that. But if anybody wants to be a mod, you can... I know, Mia, but what if you're not here? <laughs> Did I smear all of that? AliExpress. Oh, I guess there's no E. I have it on my phone. I know I do. I know. Hmm. It's a conundrum at the moment. Uh-oh. Oh, crap. I forgot to put the lid on. Bad me. I can't do that. Oh, I know what I forgot. Hi, Naughty Fritz. Thank you for coming. Your son from another universe. I know. It's crazy. But all I can say is I apologize and I hope, you know, it's not too bad computer. To Earlier today, I was trying to get the computer to work without my phone, and I couldn't get it to work, so I need to watch, like, another tutorial or something, so. So, yeah. And, oh, my God. So, Kyrie, my beautiful daughter, not her fault at all, but, so, she goes back to school on January 6th, and she goes back to school for one week, and then... She gets a four-day weekend, and then she goes to school for three days. And this is apparently due to exam break for the grade 11s and 12s. So, yeah, she goes to school for a week. Then she goes and has a four-day weekend. Then she goes for three days. And then she has two weeks off. So... She had, like, Monday and Tuesday off last week, went Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and now has the next two weeks off. Like, how ridiculous is that? I know that, you know, the grade 12s and whatnot are writing exams, but seriously, like, when I wrote exams, you know, like, people still went to school. 
Like, I just think it's absolutely insane the amount of um, time that they're getting off of school. Yep. I don't know. Why? My ear. Oh. Sorry, give me one sec. It's right there. Where my ear will touch just in my It hurt? It kind of a little bit when there's pressure on it. There's no outward sign of drama or anything. It's like right where they I feel it. And that's what happened on the side. There's a Talk to her about that when we go see her, okay? Okay. Sorry, peoples. Kyrie had something wrong with her ear and needed me to check it. So I apologize. <laughs> um, I'm trying to keep track of what I'm using. So that way if I need to go back, I know at least what I was using. The only one I can't remember is the sea anemones. I don't remember what pink I used for those, but... That's okay. So, um, <laughs> you should hear Darren talking to Kyrie about it. Oh my god, they are funny. So, so yeah, I need to figure out what color to do these things. I don't know what they are. Coral. Let's pretend they're coral. Because I was thinking of doing this piece the same color as these because they kind of look the same. And it could be coral with starfish. So like a peachy type color maybe? That's kind of, I guess, what I'm thinking. Like... Pinkier, salmonier, you know? Hi, Shelly, how are you? Thanks for joining. No, no. God damn it. No, let me, let me do this. Um, <laughs> ooh, this looks like the perfect color of what I'm thinking. Not so much, but it's close. So that gives me somewhere to start. Let's check this one. This one. How is that darker? I like the first one better. So what it was 14 then. Those colors are so, so similar. Oh my goodness. Hi, Joanna. Thanks for coming, girl. Oh God, Tracy, I saw that one. It was Gorgeous. Oh, it was so beautiful. I have diamond paint, I have to say. Redder. Less corally. I guess the first one, now that it's dry, looks more corally, like what I want. Their numbering system is very odd. So this is 13, and this was 12, so it kind of got darker. So then I tried to go up a number. That was 15. No, that was 14, sorry. And then that was 15, and this is 11. Like, 15 and 11 are almost identical, and yet it's just the... They have the weirdest numbering system on these. I don't have a new one. <laughs> or the one that I get later, I suppose. Oh, I'm so excited. So.
so, so not what I thought. Yeah. And, and the marker tips ends do not match the colors. Like maybe that one does now. Oh, most of them don't. Me and my big mouth. Oops. Okay. So 13 is what color I am going to do the coral. And then what about the bulges? <laughs> oh, I can't wait. To, I'm going to go look. Oh. Yeah, I, I, I just, I don't even know what to expect on that one. I tell you, kind of nervous. Because it's like, is it actually going to be the whole thing? Is it going to be crap and fall apart? Like, for that price, it's like a really, you know, decent size. Like, it's huge. And, you know, like, I I highly doubt it's full drill. Like, that's, I hope it is. God, that would be so awesome. But, yeah, I have no idea. It's kind of exciting not knowing, though, too. Oh, see, there I go, forgetting about the marker. Gotta be careful around the bulbs. I keep wanting to call them barnacles. I'm sure they're not barnacles, but, you know, that's what I keep wanting to say they are. That doesn't look so bad. Oh, I want to try those too, Mia. Vova. I could check that out too. That would be so cool. Because, yeah. Most. Not all. Well, no. I would put my coloring on hold for diamond painting. Take a little break. Not like a mental break, an actual break. And yeah, I could do that. I have, like, I think I went to Wish, and I sat there one night, and I went through, like, stickers, washi, and diamond paintings, and I think I have, like, probably, like, $600 worth of stuff in my cart. Like, it's ridiculous. And of course, I'm not ever going to buy it, but, you know, it's there, so that way if I want to buy one or whatever, I can, but... <laughs> Yeah, that's what I do. I go on like Amazon and I look at everything and I just add it to my cart. And then when I eventually go to buy something, I just shove everything into like my wish list and then redo it. Huh. <sighs> I'm sitting here with my tongue sticking out while I'm trying to color and not, like, let the pen bleed. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Crafty Kitty. How are you? Thanks for coming. I know. I would, you know, like, I know the reason that, you know, like, I haven't colored in a while is mental. Like, I, I just couldn't. Um, but like, not permanently or anything like that, but I would definitely, definitely do that. I think. I know it's buffering. I'm so sorry, Crafty Kitty. I don't know how to fix it. I don't. It's ridiculous.
Yeah, there. I didn't have any buffering yesterday either. Oh my gosh, you guys. Thank you, Joanna. I totally flaked. I'm so sorry, girl. Oh my god. So I got Joanna sent me a card. And so here's here's the front of it, but it's the back. So here's the back of the envelope. And oh my god. And then, so I open it, and here's the card. Is this not the most adorable thing you've ever seen? Like, oh my god, there's, like, little pom-poms and, like, rhinestones and, like, little felt things. And, I mean, Rudolph has a red nose. Like, oh my goodness. It is so cute. I love this card to death. And the only reason it is not hanging on my mirror right now is because I wanted to show everybody. And like, it is just, yeah, there's nothing inside, but oh my God, is this not the most amazing card? Like it took forever to get here. And oh my God, I sent out my cards like before Christmas and just received it. Was it you, Joanna? I don't remember, but someone literally like received my card last week. Like, how crazy is that? I love this card. And I have a mirror behind my door, um, like, leaving the house. So I have a big mirror with, like, scroll work around it. And what I do is I put my Christmas cards, like, in between the scroll work. And they stay up there all year. And then I replace them next year with new cards. So, yeah, this is my amazing Christmas card from Joanna. I'm, wow. I am so blessed and honored to have gotten that. I feel so lucky. So, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Joanna. Thank you, everybody who sent me a card. I really do appreciate it, and I love every one of them. I think I showed everyone on stream. So, I know the post is ridiculous sometimes. Like, seriously? So. Uh, thank you all so much for being here and, you know, welcoming me back and everything. Sorry I was gone for so long. But. I'm back now and it's permanent. So now you guys are like stuck with me. So. Yay. I, I, the, I have wash. I found five things of washi tape at the dollar store. And they're really pretty. I found these ones at the dollar store. And I thought they were really pretty. And they're like, I don't know, 5M. And they're quite thick. So I found those. So this is my first ever washi. So, yay! <laughs> I'm so excited, I tell ya. Uh, I missed all of you guys so much. I... Yeah, I miss you guys terribly, and I'm just so glad to be back, and yep, I am so happy right now. Couldn't get much better. Streaming, not too bad. I'd say that's a pretty successful day. I have my husband here, my child here. I need to do another drunk stream. <laughs> Patty, you do a drunk stream. I got like railroaded for that. Oh my god. I like poured a drink on another stream and I didn't even have a drink from it on stream. And then I got told I shouldn't drink on stream after that. It was quite funny. I felt bad. But yeah, I don't know how I feel about that one again. I got new socks, though. 
Oh my God, I got new socks. <laughs> yeah, it's like washi tape, but it's like way thicker. So. <laughs> Oh, I have so many plans for my planner now that I have like all this stuff and I feel like I have enough functional stickers to make it, you know, to make it worth doing. Because, I mean, if I'm just doing it for stickers, like I need to be planning. That's the whole point of it. So, yeah, I'm all excited now. Usually it's like that decorative tape that everyone uses and it's really like low tack tape. So it's kind of like painter's tape, but decorated. And this stuff is kind of like that. It's usually a paper tape. Um, but this stuff is like really thick and you can't just tear this stuff. That's like part of it. Is you, like I haven't found a way to there. But yeah, so it's like a little different from washi tape, but I mean, it's going to serve the same. There's actual lines in it and stuff. Yeah. If I do this, there's like fibers in it all together. So yeah, it's like it's duct tape, but pretty duct tape. <laughs> Oh, Mia, you're so sweet. So sweet. And you know it. So, yeah, that's what washi tape is. So I'm like, you know, all into back into coloring and diamond painting and planning and... I'm not going to be depressed anymore. I've decided no more. So. Oh. Oh, I just see. And then I just like, you know, completely railroad over a bubble. Oh. <laughs> Nobody needs to be here. Honestly, that means more than anything. Yeah, I'm a sappy fool. I know it. But it really does. Sorry, I have a hard time concentrating on coloring and talking. I don't, when I talk, when I try and see, that's what happened. I was talking and I like completely wiped over that. So I need to like not do stuff like this when I'm streaming because then I can't concentrate on the stream. Sorry, you guys. <laughs> Um, <laughs> that's true too, Mia. Oh, I have been watching Faith. Uh, no. I haven't. Um, oh, there didn't they go to Mexico? Patty? That's this week, I think. They're in Mexico this week. Faith is amazing. She's kind and caring and giving and just absolutely an amazing person. You 
decorate things with it. So like in my planner, I would use it to like, you know, if I wanted to say the page I was working on had like green stripes and I didn't want green, I could take like my tape and I could go over the stripes or I could make, cut it and make little dots and like use them as checklists and you just decorate things with them. So I have like a big happy planner. So this is to help decorate. And I was thinking that, I don't know if I really am going to, but maybe I might cut these into little squares and use them as like trackers. And then I would have pretty sparkly trackers and stuff like that. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, hold on. Let me get my scissors. I don't have anything at the moment to put it on, but um, yeah. okay. There. So if I like, you know, wanted my my meal thing to look pretty, then I could take my tape. <laughs> Oh, I have a thought. I do know what I could do with it. I have like a real thought I can do. What if I, I can tape like the, because there's a frame around her and I was debating what to do with the frame. So I can use that. And so I think maybe this color out of all of them is probably the best, right? For this type picture. Yeah, we're going to go with this one. Um, like medication and I want to, um, there's, um, uh, Mia was telling me about this new Facebook group and it's like challenge 2020 or something like that. And, um, you set challenges for yourself. So I decided to try to get back into coloring. So I, I thought my goal, I would make one picture a week. I have to color one picture. So that's my goal. So I would track that. And like, I want to keep track of, you know, like what I'm doing and stuff like that. And what the kids are up to and. So yeah, I would just take my craft knife and like cut it, but basically that's it. I should, if I mean, if I cut this back a bit, if I can Let's see if this stuff peels back. Actually, that's like a pretty, that peels back very nicely. Wow. I didn't expect that, especially not from like duct tape, but I mean, you could use this stuff to like hold a tarp down. It's got like fibers in it. This stuff is brilliant. I had no idea. Thanks, Joanna. <laughs> I wouldn't have done this yet if it wasn't for you asking. So thanks. Yeah, look at me washi taping. Um, It's like, you know, probably not interesting at all. I'm probably boring you guys to death. This is like perfect for this page, I think. I've never really done this to a page before, but I think this like is perfect. I know I'm crazy, but wow, I'm like in love with this.
Sorry, I have to finish it now. Sorry, guys. Kind of stuck now. If I was going to do this to any page, it would definitely be this page because it's for the mermaid hashtag for Jackie and for Victoria for her Hannah um, hashtag. So this is like the perfect page to, you know, fancy up a bit, I think. Well, I went off there. Uh-oh. Oops. Now I made the page bulge. Oh, well. It is what it is, I suppose. That's okay. That works. Kenny. Oh, thanks, sweetie. I really appreciate you coming in. I hope you feel better. And I hope you have a really good sleep. things I'd use it for. Getting to my planner at the moment is almost impossible, so I can't show you my planner, but there you go. Thanks, Kenny. I was showing Joanna what washi tape is and what it does and how you can use it. Even though that's like my first ever washi tape, it's still cool. Oh, I absolutely love this. I'm so glad we did this. Thank you, Joanna and Mia. Yeah. Oh, I'm in love with my page. I am so happy right now. Nice thing about like practicing with markers on a Hannah Lynn page is there's generally pretty dark and thick lines. So as long as, you know, I'm careful and, you know, cognizant of it at the moment, it doesn't bleed too badly into areas. Like, I mean, I went right over that, but I can fix that. So... Well, thanks, Abby. Night, Kenny. Sweet dreams, sweetheart. And it's mostly thanks to Heather and Victoria that I'm back. And Mia and Rochelle, actually. They've been all so very, very supportive and lovely and kind. And thank you, all of you.
Thank you so much for being here, Shelley. I really, really appreciate it. For February, thank you. What is February? I'm going to write it down so I can look at that too. Oh, Patty. I love you, girl. No. No. What? Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. I, I remember hearing about this. I understand. Okay. Very cool. Oh, I'm excited. I love colorathons. Oh, that would be cool. Then I know who to watch when. Oh, that would be awesome. I would love to come. I would, like, love to be there. I really enjoy colorathons. Gotcha, Mia. I get it. I understand. Oh, Patty. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Thanks, Joanna. Um, but a colorathon is when a group of people get together and decide they want to do a colorathon or someone wants to put it on. And then they get different people to stream at different times. But so you have like, if it was like a Friday, Saturday, Sunday colorathon streaming at all times like almost all times as much as possible all weekend and so you just go from um channel to channel and you just watch and have fun and you know like if you have to leave you can leave and you know go do your thing but you know it's there and it's so much fun because you know when people get talking it's nice to be able to go from stream to stream and you know still be able to talk to them if somebody's stream is over so yeah, I really enjoy colorathons actually. So <laughs> No, they're never like actually like streaming for 48 hours. Um it's hard to find people to stream at every time of the day, but I guess they try to fill it in as possible. I think it would be difficult to fill it in, but I've never done that. So mm -hmm. I wouldn't know. Oh, so. and I saw it was from you, so. I think they're fun, and usually if I know there's a colorathon, like, I put it on my calendar so that, you know, my family knows. And they know, like, you know, on those weekends that basically, you know, I'm unavailable and it's like a free-for-all type weekend, so... They know that I'm busy all weekend and they're content and they're fine with it. They don't care that I'm busy all weekend. So, yeah. Um, 
<laughs> so I got to write down what I did for her. I can't forget. I couldn't, I can't refine, I cannot find the color I used for the anemones in her hair. So this is coral, I think. 13. Okay, so but now I have to figure out what color to put on the bubbles. Hi, Kim, how are you? Thanks for being here. <laughs> it's a big thing, Patty, and there's like a whole diamond painting community of its own, and there's whatever craft or anything you can think of, there's a community for it. Okay, cool. Thanks, Joanna. That is awesome, Shelly. I am doing much better. Thank you, Kim, for asking. All right. What am I going to do about the bubbles on her boobs? I suppose I'll do the stars yellow. I mean, yellow would work, I suppose. So I guess we'll do yellow for the stars. Um, maybe this one. Oh, I can't wait, Shelly. I'll definitely be looking for it for sure. That's like not pretty. <laughs> That's just not pretty. <laughs> Mia, be nice, please. That's right, Joanna. Oh, Patty, you're so awesome. You don't have to do this. You know that, right? I get that you are so not into any of this. I appreciate you being here, though. It means a lot. Oh, that's like bright. Is that bright yellow or is that green? Okay. Please, please stop. Is this one yellow, you guys? Or like, is this like a more green than yellow? Like, which yellow should I use? This one or this one? I don't know if I um, should do, like, the bright, bright yellow or the deeper yellow. Anybody? I don't know if the bright yellow is too bright or if the other one's too orange. There's like not a whole lot in between. Um, the bright one, I can't do it on there. Why? Well, I, I feel like all my yellows look like browns, like. Ochres, I suppose. This one? Cool. Thanks, Joanna. 
I will use that one. All right, 37 goes back in here. All right, I have to store this thing on the floor because, you know, it's just too darn big to fit on the table and let me color at the same time. So, okay. So, stars. That's 45. Awesome. There, that looks pretty. I think it's the right one. Good choice, Joanna. I wonder if they actually have like a more peachy, corally color that I was looking for. Because that's what I kind of wanted to do. And those spots, I think, would work in the peachy coral color. Okay, um, so uh, um, I'm sorry. Um, I'm going to go. I'm sorry. Um, I'm going to go because, um, mm -hmm. I'm not ready for this. <laughs> so I definitely am coming back. Um, thank you all so much for being here. I'm really sorry. <laughs> um, I really do appreciate being here, but yeah, I'm... oh my god, I'm so stupid. Oh, God. Oh, God. <sighs> <clears throat> How's Camden doing, Patty? Please, Tracy, stop, please. I just need everyone to stop. <laughs> One of my favorite people. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
Okay, that was good. <laughs> um Oh crap. Um Oh Yeah. <laughs> I'm good. I'm okay. And you know, as long as I'm one of Patty's favorite peas, I'm good. <laughs> Alrighty, we got the stars done. Oh, they have this really pretty gray. <sighs> Jump in a circle. <laughs> oh, you guys are funny. They have this gray, and it says it's yellow gray. And I don't know about all that, but it's, like, really perfect for the pearls, I think. I don't know. I'm a little crazy, so who knows. <laughs> Wasa. You want to be a favorite P, too? <laughs> we can all be peas. <laughs> We're Patty's favorite peas. I'm lucky if that's what I am. So, yeah, here it is. This one is like that. I was thinking, oh, I'm blind. I don't know. That one's very light. They have like the whole range of them. So but they just look like perfect pearl colors. I don't know. I mean, I don't know if that's just the paper being wet or if it's like the actual color. No, you don't want to be a pea. <laughs> if it's Patty's pea, it's okay. <laughs> Patty loves me. There, that's like more. Yeah, that one. Is it really though? It's hard to tell if it's just like wet paper or if it's the actual color. I like those though. I think I like that one. Let's see what four is. <laughs> Joanna. Oh my god, I'm gonna find some like really cool toilet paper to send, I promise. <laughs> oh, good. That's funny. <laughs> oh, what was I doing with this? Oh, pearls. Right. Pearls. Ha. I couldn't remember what I was doing with it. Well, maybe, see, now maybe it's not dark enough. I still think the color's good, though. Go back over another time and darken it a bit. Is that, I don't know, is that, do the markers work that way? I have a lot to learn about markers. I was at um, Kit and Clowder, and they do, like, a free beginner class on pencils and markers so I want to take both of those classes but especially the marker one because I have no idea what to do with them and it's wonderful to watch like Belinda work with them and stuff like that but I mean I just I 
it's like magic watching that. And I have no idea how that works. So I have to figure out the magic first. (laughs) Oh my God. I would have to get like Justin Trudeau toilet paper and at least he's good looking if he's going to be, you know, wiping up down there. (sighs) Justin Trudeau wiping my ass. Wouldn't that be incredible? (laughs) I bet it is. I bet somebody has made Trump toilet paper. (laughs) Don't want Trump hooch disease. <laughs> no, I I don't think I would want anything that had ever been near that man. Ugh. My whole vagina just squeezes shut when I think of that one. All right, orangey coral color. Let's see what we can find in this mess of colors. So 16 looks like it should be exactly what I'm looking for. Where is it? And no, it is not. Oh, actually. Maybe it is. I mean, it's like not for sure, but that's like coral. That's kind of exactly what I wanted. This is what I should have done the other one, not the bumps with. I should have done the whole thing with this color. (laughs) They have it on Amazon. (laughs) He's having an impeachment party tonight. Of course you're number one. You're the oldest. That matters, Patty. <laughs> I cannot believe he's having an impeachment party. What? My God, what kind of man, what kind of human does stuff like that? Like, ugh. But Trudeau isn't any better. I mean, okay, yeah, he is, but not much as far as politically speaking goes. Trudeau is not worse than Trump. Trump doesn't give millions of dollars to terrorists. Yes, he does. They're both just crazy. I hope he gets impeached. But I mean, if he doesn't even care that this is like happening, I really don't understand how it's going to work. Like, he obviously doesn't care one way or the other. So how are they going to force him to leave office? I mean, he doesn't care. I don't know. Like, do they take him out with like, you know guns drawn or whatever now see that color looks too similar now (sighs) (laughs) thanks Mia (laughs) yeah he uh, he's he's something else I don't understand politics at all but I mean, our um, Alberta guy, my God, I'm dumb, our our premier of Alberta is Jason Kenney, and that man makes my stomach hurt and my skin crawl, like, he the ads that he put out when he was running and just some of the stuff he was saying and stuff like that. He just, Oh my God, he is, he would be in Trump's 
camp, 100%. And he's just gross. He's like a slime ball. And he, he literally makes my stomach hurt. Ugh. Well, that's cool. At least you, like, understand things. Like, I don't really understand much about politics at all. Oob. Spots. Cool. Oh. And another one goes, and another one goes, and another one bites the dust. I would, like... I think it would just be very cool to like at least know something like I really know nothing about politics like when it comes time to vote I decide what's important to me and I go and I look at the candidates and who they are what they stand for and whichever one best aligns with what I want and need at the time is who I vote for so No, good and bad is pretty. And, like, Trump is bad. He's just a bad man, like, in general. Even before politics and everything, he's just a bad human being. Like, I don't know. Oh. I didn't even think of her tail. elections most um, elections whether they're municipal federal or provincial and I love working them and I love counting the ballots like I'm really sad for a time when like my job won't be needed anymore because I love working the elections they're fun to work. I mean, you have to go to classes and stuff, but, you know. But I mean, when, when they give you your options and really there's not an option that makes a hill of beans of difference good one way or the other, I think, I think democracy is overrated. Like, only having two political parties to vote for. And... That is very cool. And of course, you do have a pic of her with your dogs. You have, like, the biggest dogs I swear that I've ever seen you have like your 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 dogs are huge but they're gorgeous you can tell you take care of your dogs like and your pictures with them are so awesome Joanna I love looking at your stuff I go there and I just like randomly look around and look at pictures of your dogs because I'm weird like that you know that's what I do so I can't answer my phone while I'm streaming. <laughs> They're just big boned. That's good. <laughs> they are so gorgeous, Joanna. Honestly, like, so oh, now I feel like I have to do her like tail to match her bra. And I didn't intend to do that. Gosh darn it. Ariel has purple cups, purple shells, and a green tail. So I could change the color. Our date date. <laughs> God, 
Joanna, you are so funny. I love you. You're the best. All right, let's do it different. So I need a new piece of paper, but I have to still write it down. So I'm going to slip it. All right, let's see what color. I was thinking like more pink. I don't want to add like a huge amount of color. Oh, Mia, you should see Joanna's dogs. They are huge. Like, they are monster dogs, but they're gorgeous. And oh my God, the hair on these things. Joanna, how does your, like, how do you not constantly have like balls and gobs of dog hair all over your house? I wondered that. They're 110 pounds. I didn't realize that. My goodness. How much of that is hair? <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> what kind of puppy did you get? I forget. Or did you just get the puppy? Is this a different puppy? Yeah, they are gorgeous dogs. And you take the best pictures. You are so pretty, Joanna, by the way. And yeah. You take the best pictures with your dogs. It's awesome. Whoa. Whoa, really? There is no way that is this color. Holy shit. That's like brown. Is there any pink or red in this? I don't see any pink or red. <laughs> oh, you got a husky. What is its name? Sam, let's start. <laughs> I don't know. Seriously, what the? This one at least looks like what it should look like. That one's just brown. Really? Oh, no. What am I doing? Right, I'm looking for tail colors. Right, right, right. Maybe. Whoa. So not what I was expecting. Again. These are very interesting colors. You said I think they're awesome, but it does have a lot of energy. Shiloh. Oh, right. Sorry, Patty. I forgot. I'm sorry. That's a very cool name. Seriously, none of these colors are like what they should be.
Wow. Holy. Does she look like Dieter at all? Sorry, I, I'm still, I haven't swatched these yet, so I'm still in utter shock at the uh, difference, I suppose, in what it is and what it comes out like. You know, I've never colored a mermaid tail before. I'm not really sure how to go about this. <laughs> I just said that out loud and Darren's like, with your crayons. He's right, of course, but yeah. I don't really know how to, like, am I, I know, I know I'm, I can do what I want, but like, is it better to do like one color here and then have like another color here? Or do I like alternate colors? Or do I do like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to color a, a mermaid tail. Um, Jackie, what do you think? You've colored lots of mermaids. What would you do? If you're there still. I don't know how to blend with markers. Pink, glitter pens. I do have glitter gel pens. Should I put like a, an alcohol marker color underneath it and then put gel pen on top? Okay, okay, so what if I just stick to the color I did her top then, and then we can, like, sparkle it up. Maybe that would just be easier because, you know, I, ju I just haven't had a chance to swatch them, and, well, actually, I haven't had a ruler to make my swatch sheet, which is why I haven't swatched them, but, yeah, so... I don't really know how, you know, what the colors are quite yet, so, yeah. Mm -hmm. Thanks, guys. I'm just nervous. Uh, I don't know why. So, I'm going to do this all pink, and then I'm going to do pink and yellow, like, stripes for her. Um, tail. What do you think? Is that okay? Do you think that'll look pretty? Like, I know it's okay if I do it, but I want it to look pretty. <laughs> no, I don't, ha I don't have any nervous traits or ear, you know, all, any of that. Boy. You know how, like, you know, in the winter, you kind of get the wind, like, the winter blues? So, I get that, but it's, like, really bad. Usually, we up my antidepressants in the winter, but I'm on a new one that we're not supposed to have to do that. So, I, I find I don't think it's working very well in the winter, but they are very expensive, too. So, that's part of it. And, yeah, they just don't help. So, okay. I understand. Thank you, Patty. And 
Are you going to be home tomorrow at all? Because I, I could call. Ooh, where was that place, Mia, that you found the glitter watercolors? Um, oh, I don't remember. I didn't get it on the edge there. God oh, damn it. Etsy? Yeah. Okay, right. Right, right. Okay. 45. There we go. Let's pull that one. Holographic paints. Really, Joanna? See, in the summer, like, I sit outside and I can sit outside for, like, hours and sit there and... Well, give me a call tomorrow or let me know what time and I can call you. I love you, Patty. I miss you. I wish I could be there. I would be there if I had any way to get there. Okay, sweetie. I know. Thanks, Mia. <laughs> yeah, I I swim, but I don't I don't like the heat. Like I don't like when it's plus thirty either. Um like at all. I suffer when it's like that, but I would rather sit outside on a plus 20, 23, four day. And I will sit outside and just sit on my front steps and they're terribly uncomfortable, but I love sitting out there on my steps. And so, and like, I don't get any vitamin D in the winter. So that's part of it. I don't think that my multivitamin is working. But, yeah, I need to start taking some vitamin D. So I get very depressed in the winter. It's, it's kind of sad. It's pathetic. But I can't stop it. So. so I've been a little depressed as of late. But I'm trying very hard to put that behind me. And not be depressed. So, that's my new goal. <laughs> if you want, Patty, you could put your Instagram name up and then people could find you. And they would look at your pictures and stuff. If you want. But that's where I post all my stuff, so. Are you under Patricia Hassenstein on Instagram? I don't remember. I think you are. <laughs> Thank you, Patty. I love you, and I will talk to you tomorrow.
<laughs> you guys are all very awesome. Thank you for being so kind. So since I've, like, never decorated a picture with tape or, like, anything extra, like, I have some, like, glitter glue from Michael's, but I've never actually used it on a picture. And I think I have some Wink of Stella upstairs that I've never opened. So I could get that stuff out for, like, my next picture and then maybe try out some of that stuff. That might be cool. So, where's the edge there? Yes. Yeah, she's okay with it. So, yeah. I think maybe I'll try practicing some, like, fake stickles and Wink of Stella next time. We'll see how that goes. So. Um. Like Jade Summer and Hannah Lynn and... Oh yeah, Sassy Dragonfly. I know I love your stuff, Jackie. I love watching you like embellish stuff when you're done. Like you're just like... Oh, you are just awesome. You just go to town with it. I love it. I just don't have that confidence yet. Because I've never used it before. So I don't even think of it generally. But that's okay. Now I have, and now I might use it. See, I don't think this is going to work. There. And then this one should be yellow. Uh-oh. And it should be pink. Uh-oh. Well, I guess I can make it pink. It'll be pink now. Because kind of can fuddle it around up here, I think, maybe. Yeah, I think that should be okay. Crap on a cracker. Patty's pretty awesome. She's my older sister. She's five years older than me. But she means the world to me. Yes, that is her. Jackie's coloring is awesome. I love watching her color. So funny. My goodness, that girl is funny. Right, Jackie? You crack me up all the time. Like, you and Joanna and you guys are, like, two of the funniest people I know. My younger sister is funny. That really bites. Oh well, get over it. As my husband would say, build a bridge and get over it. <laughs> That's what he says to me all the time. Build a bridge and get over it. And it's like, you know, it's only things really. Dad, actually. 
which is weird to say, but my dad is like that. He, uh, he just kind of, you know, moves on. So sorry about the stream, you guys. I know it's not doing well. This is so not how I envisioned this turning out, but I don't hate it. I mean, I'm not in love with it, but I don't hate it. And I think it was like a good picture to start with my alcohol markers because, you know, I was looking through the book trying to decide on a picture and like a, most of the pages are pretty detailed and since I've never used alcohol markers before, not really, I didn't want to like go into a bunch of detail because I didn't know if, how much they would bleed or anything like that. So I think this was a good picture to pick. God. Not that we really want to burn any bridges. I don't want to burn any bridges. I can tell you that, but <laughs> oh, that was funny. <laughs> oh, Darren will like that when I tell him later. He will like that a lot. God, Joanna, <laughs> what am I going to do with you, girl? You are so fucking funny. I'm sorry. My bad. But yeah, you are. <laughs> All right. What do I do for the background now? Um, <laughs> light blue, I think, is on the menu. If I can find a light blue that I like. So 13 goes here. All right. So I need like either, a, maybe, no, I, I did the seahorses like teal. So I can't do it teal. Kim, don't be sorry, girl. That's awful that they would twist that. I, I don't know how they would, but my God, I'm really sorry, Kim. So, hmm. 
It's too dark. To go much, much lighter than that. Or bluer, I don't know. That's bluer. So this one should be pretty light. Should be. Oh, look at that. Do we like that one? I like that one. Is that a water blue though? Or do I need a blue or blue? Oh, see, this is where I run into problems. Is like I start thinking and then my thinking just makes a mess of things. Kim's niece fell in a lake. It was beyond tragic. Oh, wait. What color did I do her eyes? Oh, that's the color I did her eyes. That's maybe why I like that color. No, not that one. What about this one? Oh, wow. That's like so dark. Oh, there we go. I haven't used this one. That's a nice, pretty blue. Do I like this one or this? Um. <gasps> Ooh, I could do the bubbles in the light one. Oh, okay, yay! I think that look pretty. Yeah, it's very sad. Tragic accident. It's a very scratchy pen. What? He got out. What does... I'm sorry, Kim. I'm not going to make you talk about it. Because I don't understand. But... I'm sorry. Sorry, I'm excited to finish this picture now. I'm all like, woo! Like, I only have this much left, and, you know. But. 
That's still quite a bit to color, I guess. What the hell? <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god, Kim. That is... Wow. I, there's not even words for that. What? What is their damage? Because seriously, they have got to be damaged to do this stuff. Like what, their 15 minutes of fame wasn't good enough how it happened? And so they need to make more? Jesus. Wow. That is... Well, that's disgusting. Right, Jackie? Yeah, that probably wouldn't hurt. I mean, it wouldn't hurt anything at this point, I suppose, right? That's just insane. Absolutely insane. Keep losing the bubble. Well, I guess not too bad. I lost that bubble and that one. But actually, it hasn't been too bad. And plus, I'll add white afterwards to the bubbles and try and make them look a little shiny. But they won't look for her, and they won't let you look for her. What the hell do they expect? And yes, it's a crime scene, but I mean, technically a crime didn't happen. So releasing a scene like that, I mean, 
there's not even really a scene. Like, how can they keep it closed? <laughs> what time is it, Darren? I know, never mind, 10.42. All right. I guess I'll finish coloring in this section and then I should go because it's getting late. So. Darren goes to bed right around now and I have to go and count my pills. So get them ready for tonight and tomorrow morning because my sweetheart of a husband is awesome. And instead of like me having to wake up and, you know, take my pills and try and go back to sleep, he wakes me up nicely. And then he makes sure that I take my medicine properly and whatnot. But then I don't even like really have to wake up. Like I wake up enough to, you know, turn on a light to take my, like I just turn on my phone light or my book light, depending whichever I have on me at the moment. So I either turn on my Kindle or my phone and then I take my CBD and I have my pills already like counted out and ready and he passes them to me so I don't drop them or anything. And then I take my pills and he gets the bottle back and then I go back to sleep or I try to anyway. And being that I don't have to actually like wake up, wake up, it helps a lot in the getting back to sleep thing. So he's an amazing dude. So I don't want to keep him up any later than I have to either. That wouldn't be very nice. Oh, I guess, right? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. I mean, he does it every morning so that I don't have to fully wake up and worry about, you know, taking my meds. And, you know, it's early enough that my body hasn't, you know, started going through withdrawal or anything. So it really makes it so I don't have to get up. And, like, I'm one of those people that I can't generally sleep once I'm, like, awake awake. So doing it this way allows me to at least have the possibility of falling back to sleep. So, and yeah, more often than not, I do, if not for, and if not, like, I can lay there sometimes. And because I haven't gotten out of bed and gotten cold and all of that, I can sometimes put on a YouTube video and, you know, put myself back to sleep that way, but. Without him, I would be up at, you know, 6.30 every morning and wouldn't be able to go back to sleep. So, he is my amazing husband. And I'm so proud of him and my kids. So, and because it's Darren's birthday and Kyrie had something come up this weekend... We get to, um, Morgan and Nina are coming back over on Sunday and we get to celebrate Darren's birthday on Sunday with the kids. So that is super awesome because, you know, I don't get to see Morgan generally that often. So seeing her, you know, like on a Saturday and then the next Sunday is like a really big deal. So I'm super excited. So... So yeah, I am going. I just, you know, keep finding these little spots that are just, you know, little. As you can tell, I don't want to go. <laughs> right, Joanna? So, and I, do, I have problems having naps. Yes, today is Darren's birthday. 
Joanna and Mia say happy birthday, Darren. He says thank you. All right, I'm going to go. Thank you all so much for being here and all of that. I really, really appreciate it. And I will be back hopefully tomorrow or the next day. And then we'll finish this one. I'll probably do the background, but I probably won't do any of like the sparkly stuff until I come back on stream. And then we'll do some sparkly stuff. And yeah, maybe I can get like the glitter glue out and stuff like that. So, all right. Thank you guys all so much. I love all of you. And thank you for being here. I appreciate it.